Here we go. Overwatch 2. Oh my goodness, we're back in it. So, uh, it's been a long, long time since I played Overwatch. I tried last week to get into Overwatch 2 as much as possible. Nice. Gosh. And I could not get into matches to save my life, dude. It was like that in forever queue, the timers that you couldn't... Oh, come on, finish that kill. We need to get Anna. Nice. Good play. Um, I loved Overwatch when it was in beta, like the original beta. And I absolutely loved uh, playing it in 2017-ish. Like when I built my PC, I played a lot of Overwatch. Um, it was never very good, but I just enjoyed it. It was a game I had a big group of friends who would play, and that made it a lot better. So wanted to come back for Overwatch 2. I have definitely watched some of the videos this last week talking about how this is um, an interesting way to call a game a sequel. It's really just a fresh coat of paint. Some balance changes and... I'm wondering, nice, if COVID um, did what it did with everything, where it impacted development pretty substantially. But anyway, uh, if you're playing Overwatch 2, let me know. How is it? Let me know what you think. I'm very curious. They are not getting out of this spawn so far. But it only takes one good wipe, man. Only takes one good wipe. It does seem like the solo potential is a lot higher. I need to bail. I've heard that the outplay as a solo player, like the intent of that decision is quite a bit. Should we go for it? Sure, why not? Yeah. Oh my gosh, 76 was so fun. It does have that ultra tight blizzard polish feel. I've heard if you are on mouse and keyboard, there can be a floaty aim feel to it. Uh, a lot of that coming down to um, the NVIDIA late, what is it, latency thing, the reflex setting, like dialing that back is important. Okay, now they're finally getting their tank out of there. So I probably haven't played the game for like the last seven heroes that have been released. So all I know is <laughs> there's a bunch of characters who I don't know, I don't know how they work. And I did not follow any of like the competitive scene for Overwatch, honestly. 76 is getting irritating. We need to get up there. Come on, Dragoon. Jump, jump, jump. Movement's pretty bad right now. Got him. Let's -a go. And it's like all old man 76 now. He's got like the beard and everything. And they changed McCree's name, <clears throat> name I think, right? Back out of there. I don't want to get too pinched. It's so ultra tight. I think that's the thing that's so um, difficult about Overwatch for me is because it's got that crazy, crazy polish. This, I mean, I don't know if you can call it sequel. Good try, buddy. Ooh, cool job. Well, whatever. It, it'll probably get me to play a little bit of it. That was a total misclick. Don't drop on me. Don't drop on me. All right, this might be the, the quickest game ever, <laughs> in which case <laughs> we'll definitely play another match and I'll try a different role or different hero out. But gosh, do you also remember like every game had to be a hero shooter for so long after this? Like every game. But they're healer. That's Lucy, all right? Yeah. Come on, Dragoon. Oh, no, we're done. Nice job. All right, question. Do you think if they didn't call it Overwatch 2 and there was a little bit better marketing for it, like Overwatch 2.0 or something or Update 2.0, do you think that would change your perception of this or like maybe the general people's perception of it? Oh my gosh, I got murdered there. Good game. That was fun. Uh, we're just in quick play, so we're, we're not going to swap sides, I don't think. Yeah. Well, that was fun. Okay. I will endorse, um, are you the healer? Sure. Everyone's been endorsed. Okay. Oh man. Nice hook. Oh no. Nice. Let's go. Let's go, dude. 
Oh, this is cool. The robot moves. Wow. Like I said, I went into this thinking I was going to be pretty not into it, but I'm, I'm enjoying it right now. So I am curious, though, what about the PvE? I thought that was like most of the marketing was the PvE stuff like earlier, like a few years ago, how they were going to do this campaign. And are they still doing that? Sounds like they were working on like a live service style game, like with single player PvE components. I kind of want that. Nice. Dude. I forgot. Doesn't the... Okay, does the, the shift reload? I think the shift reloads, doesn't it? Yeah. Nice. Oh, man, it's generous. It feels a little bit generous. Let's get back to the Roboto. Domo Origato, Mr. Roboto. Get that 76 out of there. I'm also in a weird position right now. Nice, man. Ah, oh. <laughs> see, I could, I could definitely see getting sucked back into this. Probably dead. Nice. Nice. Come on, dragoon. Nice. Oh gosh, wow. That guy just laid down the law. Oh my word. That was a beautiful high noon. I did not expect that at all. I think what is so compelling too about if they were to do something PvE is they have such a cool, you know, setup right now from all their experience developing World of Warcraft. You've got tank healers, deeps with some very nice tight mechanics. I mean, Overwatch is titan which is a scrapped you know class-based mmo right nice shot so i could totally see getting into like a very polished pve if it had that old school blizzard polish like a pve mode on this thing raids etc like that could be really really cool keep the multiplayer component going but there's a lot of people who just like enjoy the overwatch art style and universe and you think about it at the time like it was perfect like it was all the right things at the right time between the art style and the gameplay, and that's why it blew up so fast. It was, I think, their fastest, um, it was their fastest growing franchise or something like that. It made a zillion, gajillion dollars so fast. Gosh. Oh my gosh, let's go, dude. Where'd he go? Come on. I'm going, I'm going. Let's roll. Okay. Gosh. Fun, 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 fun. I like the robots, dude. Nice. Nice. Oh, it's close. Oh my gosh. Ah, I'm poisoned. So weak. Nice. Oh my gosh. Woo. That was close, man. GG. All right. I enjoyed it. I don't know what all is different because I haven't been playing it in the last few years. Probably wouldn't have called it a, a sequel, but whatever. Yeah, this guy was a beast, man. Also, that skin's amazing. So thank you very much for watching this video. Let me know what you think down below about Overwatch 2, and we will see you again very soon.